is so windy and so hot. When we came from Berlin, it was zero degrees and now it's like 22 degrees here. And I am totally in shock, but it's a very positive shock. Now we are at this car rental agency and we're just gonna go pick up our car and let's see how it goes. As they say, there's always something that could go wrong when you travel. And for us, it was our rental car. We booked this car for five days in coast for 85 euros, which is actually an amazing deal. But we didn't bring the payment method with which we reserved the car. And it was a huge problem. It took three hours for us to take care of everything. We definitely got really late with our plans. So first evening in coast, we really didn't do anything. Since our hotel was all inclusive, we just decided to check in and just go for dinner. But before that, let's just have a quick room tour because it's only a matter of time that it's all gonna be messy. So let me just get it out of the way and we'll meet you tomorrow. Good morning from Coast. I wish I could wake up to this view every day. Day two was all about enjoying our resort and the island of Cardomania. Unfortunately, I lost all of my footage from day two, but I still have a lot of footage from my mobile phone so you guys can see how beautiful everything was. We spent one hour exploring the town of Cardomania, which is very beautiful by the way. And other than that, we just had beach day. We swam, we had a lot of drinks and dinner and coffee. Day two, was probably one of my most favorite days. We have the Skisha. Today we are going for the island tour and let's come with us. The best thing about taking guided tour is you get to know so many information that you would otherwise not. For example, this island has Greek flag over it. That means that this island belongs to Greece. You have to kind of mark your territory. <laughs> How cool is that? The guided tour in itself was really informative and the boat was really cute. I tried to get some pictures from the inside but I couldn't because there were a lot of people. And we are already arriving at our first spot. Over to our first uh, location. We are not going to stop in the island, but people can just like jump over the deck and like swim from here because it's a swimming stop. Ooh. Yeah! Talk, 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 talk. No, my thumb. How do you feel? Oh, it's so great. The water. The water, water is, is so clear. The water. Okay. Bye then. Off you go. After swimming in our first spot, it was already time for lunch. We had it in the boat. It was really well organized. We each paid 30 euros for this boat trip, but it was totally worth it. So I highly recommend this tour. Two o'clock we depart. Please don't be late. Hi guys. So we are at Kalimnos. We came to the second island of this tour and we're gonna explore it a little bit more. churches and you can see that there are churches where there's like little little cross and I find them so cute because like um, Greeks are really um, mostly it's not a generalization but wherever you go in Greece you will find too many churches because I think they're very religious and there are always little churches everywhere look <laughs> there's Home grenade! <laughs> it's like a tree and there it was like completely ripe. It was already down on the ground. I didn't pick it up, so I will take it with me to the hotel as a reminder that we were here. 
I love something like that when you just like get things like that and you can remember that we got it from this place. Look how many. <laughs> when you're in Berlin, there's no way you're gonna get a coffee which costs 250 and we got this from this village, this coffee frappe. By the way, side note, when you're in Greece, you have to try the Fredo Cafe or Frappe. They make it the best. But we got it for 250 Like, it's insane. And it really tastes really, really good. Oh my God, that is... Hi! Hi! <laughs> and now off we go to the third island of Seremos. It took another one hour of ferry ride to get there. So in total, the whole boat trip was five to six hours. The third and last stop of this three island cruise tour. It has been really good so far <laughs> and yeah we'll see if we can like swim here for a bit every stop is like one hour you get one hour to like go out stretch your legs kind of explore what's going on i'll show you like they're so cute um handmade things here and you can also buy something some souvenirs with you to take home yay I was really clever and I did not bring any cover up and I didn't bring any hair ties so now I can't go in the water right now because when I go in the water my hair gets dirty and I don't have anything to tie it up you guys might not be interested in this information but for me it's really important so right now I cannot go in the beach or in the water but we have the whole day planned for the island tour for Sunday anyways and then I will be completely ready then but look how clear the water is! You can literally see everything here. Look, probably I've never seen such a clear water. Here, fishy fishy. Ah, it's coming to have my skin burn. Ah, it's coming for my feet. <laughs> Guys, maybe first time in my life I saw dolphins. There are dolphins all over here. So much fun! Look, you guys can see it right now. And on this note, the part one of these vlog series is already coming to an end. These three days were very fulfilling, but stay tuned for the next part of the vlog where we get to visit the coast city, explore all the ancient sites and the tree of Hippocrates, and there's a very special surprise. We get to hike and drive to the remotest island of coast where there was literally not a single soul. So stay tuned for part two. 